I am the president of the uh, Central Railway Model and Historical Association. That's this museum. They decided, well, we're going to build this at a certain era in time. And for some reason, they came up with 1958. So this entire layout is, is 1958 or before. This little village right here has, has a lot of interesting things about it. Um, there's a bar. It's a biker bar. And they've had a fight in the bar, and there's a man being thrown through the window. It's based on the Southern Railroad. Uh, we have a, another railroad called the Central Railroad, which never existed, but this is the central, the town of Central, so we wanted a central railway system. These cars, these engines are taken apart, uh, gone through and completely cleaned. Uh, they put decoders in them, which allows them to be remote controlled, and also puts the sound inside this little engine. So it sounds like a real engine when it's running around. We have this model railroad, which is the HO gauge, which is, on, is our main part. And then we have two toy train layouts. We have an American Flyer, which is in the room over here. And then this room back behind you is the Line L room, which we have under construction. And that's the toy trains. That's the ones that have all the little cattle cars with the cows moving and going into the cars and uh, milk cars and all kind of little accessories that you always saw in the, in the store windows when they put trains in the store windows. I thought I knew a lot about model railroading until I came here and found out I didn't know anything. And uh, it's, it's just been extremely interesting, but I thoroughly enjoy it.